Hi, it's your coach Joe Lucas. Welcome to this very special Practice Power Daily Coaching video for Thursday, July 24th, 2014. Hope you're having a great week. You know, I, I wrote the post today, really, as, as I've been thinking about this for the last several weeks. I always look at, if you will, the kind of the culture of our industry. And what I've always found, I always, I always say this at my live events, you know, we don't operate as an industry, as a profession, in true reality. Uh, it's warped in a lot of different ways. You, know, you see advisors uh, making a couple hundred thousand dollars a year, feeling like absolute failures. And I just remember the story uh, last December in our business planning event in Orlando. I had, uh, had an attendee. And they were just like, oh, well, how was your year? Oh, it's horrible. You know, I only did about $350,000 or I think $400,000 of production. And, you know, I mean, and he went on and on and on how life sucked. And I remember I said to him, I said, look, let's, and so let's take your story. And we were at the uh, Orlando Airport uh, Hyatt. I said, let's go downstairs where those long lines of people are waiting to get on those airplanes, right? And I want you to tell them your story. I want you to tell them how you're miserable making two hundred thousand dollars a year. You know, you're miserable having control over your over your your days and your hours and when you need to be in the office and when you don't. All those freedoms. How miserable you are with everything going on around you. And and I said it just like that. And the reason why is that person had no gratitude. They weren't grateful. You know, they looked at everything they didn't have. And I'll say this, comparisons in our industry is a, a, a double-edged sword and B, a very dangerous game. Now, a lot of firms play that game. You know, they want to shower the top producers. You know, for years, you've been told, you know, million-dollar producer. You know, we hear these terminologies. And, you know, if you hear something long enough, it starts becoming part of your blueprint. And when it becomes part of your blueprint, you start comparing it. You start contrasting yourself versus it. And, and I'll say this, I've got clients who will do, you know, two fifty to $400,000 a year, you know, working at in, independent, working from home, some of the happiest, uh, grateful, you know, just living life large to the fullest. And then I run across people making $2 million a year, and you think they're ready to commit suicide, and then everything in between. And the reason why I say this to everybody today is, look, if you don't come from gratitude, and I don't know your personal situations, most of you. You know, I don't know where you are on the production ladder, uh, but I do know this. You have opportunity. You know, the reality is that if you want to change your circumstances, show me another industry, show me another profession where you can turn around just like that by making a decision, by taking. And I don't want to hear the stories about, well, compliance in my firm and they won't let me do anything. Look, that's you're just telling yourself the story that allows you to be mediocre. It's a story. It's a, it's a pattern you're running. And the other thing I want to say is that, you know, when you're grateful, when you're when you kind of feel good, and I'm not saying we're achieving all of our goals and there's still not a lot of work to do, but you're grateful for the opportunity, for the challenge, if you will. You approach life differently. You approach prospects differently. You approach colleagues differently. You know, you're 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 not as emotional. You're you accept the quote-unquote failures of our industry, of our business, very differently. And I'm not saying here, so for those who don't miss, don't you know, don't have a misconception. What I'm saying is, hey, you shouldn't be trying to strive and achieve your goals and everything else. What I'm saying is, be happy for where you are today, and understand you have a tremendous opportunity to do something great tomorrow. You know, so many of us in this industry, uh, you know, we look to the million-dollar producer, and if you really think about it, index for inflation. It's really $2 million. You know, so this whole million dollar you know, producer stuff, it's, look, $2 million is really where it's at today because I've been hearing about million dollar producers for 20 some odd years. So it's really, so if you want to really kind of you know, warp yourself a little bit, hey, million dollars, that's nothing. That, that's average. Let's go to two, two million is where the real standard is today. Be happy. Be grateful for what you have. Strive to be better. I've always said move the needle. You know, 5, 10, 15, 20% a year. I don't care where you are in your career cycle. Human beings need to feel like we're accomplishing something in order to feel good about things. You sh Show me a human being who's happy with the status quo. Now I'll show you somebody who's disinterested, dispassionate, and basically going through the motions. So last thing I want to say is, hey, I've enjoyed the last five plus years doing these. 
and uh, sharing my ideas. And some of you love it. Some of you kind of, mm, I don't know about that. But here's something I'm doing that I have not done in five plus years. I'm taking a week off. So this will be my last daily coaching video until we hit the month of August. I think August 4th, Monday. And uh, I've got some work to do, some projects I'm working on, strategic week for me. And uh, I'm just going to step away from this for a while. That's why this is one of the little longer ones. Uh, it does not mean I may not be communicating. I may be sending you some brain foods and some goodies. Uh, but I just probably won't be seeing me for a week or so. Have a great day today. Be grateful for the gift of this industry. Have a wonderful weekend and next week. Finish up July with excellence, achieving your goals, and getting ready for a dynamite August. Look, August is the month where your fall results, September, October, November, you sow those seeds in August. Have a great week or so. See you Monday, August 4th.